Hi, welcome to Hip Hop News Weekly. We talk about everything that happened hip hop this week and try to be as respectful as possible. Now, this is probably the first time ever that we had three female, I guess we can say artists, influencers, get arrested in the same week, you hear me? We had Sexy Red get arrested at the airport. We had um, Tommy from Love of Hip Hop get arrested. We had Krishan Rock get arrested at Blueface Hearing, you feel me? We ain't seen Krishan Rock in like four or five months. Thank God. Thank God she went missing, you feel me? I guess she had a warrant. She never showed up. She went to court thinking that they wasn't going to arrest her. She got booked, you feel me? So Krishan got booked. And then Tommy, I think, what, she, she beat some guy up in Miami. She got arrested for that. After that, she started giving back to some school, bought Papa John's. Like, come on, bro. I seen right through that. I seen right through that, Tommy. I ain't gonna lie. I seen you trying to clean that up. I seen right through that. I seen right through that. Sexy Red, you feel me? Her husband was like a brawl, you feel me? She's like in a brawl at the airport. She was at a brawl out in the airport, you feel me? Um, A lot to do about nothing. I ain't gonna lie. A lot to do about nothing. Very quiet week in hip-hop, you feel me? Very, very quiet week. You know how you can tell? Because we had Stephen A versus Peter Rosenberg. Yes, Stephen A versus Peter Rosenberg. I guess Rosenberg didn't like um, Stephen A's comments about Caitlin Clark not making Team USA team for the women's. So he said something about it. And then Stephen A went on his podcast, basically said that Rosenberg is trying to sway the black people. <laughs> He's trying to take from black culture, basically. You feel me? They had a little back and forth. That's about nothing. You feel me? Um, Shannon Sharp re-signed with First Take, which is crazy because he just got there a year ago. So uh, I don't think he was on a one-year deal. So he must have just ripped up his contract and gave him a whole new one. You feel me? I want to see what Stephen A. going to get. Because they signed Pat McAfee to some big money. They signed Shannon Sharp to some big money, obviously. Because they're making announcements about it on the show and all of that. Um, I want to see what Stephen A. is going to get when his contract is up. Because he's the executive producer of First Take. He's on NBA Countdown. He does the morning show on Get Up. Mad shit, you feel me? I want to see what Stephen A's contract going to look like. Um, you know what else I've been thinking about? Where is DJ Khaled? <laughs> I know that's why I ran them, but where is DJ Khaled? We had all of these rap beefs going on. Drake versus Future and Metro Buman. Drake versus Kendrick Lamar. Drake versus Rick Ross. Quavo versus Chris Brown. Khaled has been quiet, you feel me? He's the DJ that comes together and put everybody on the record. He's the one that does that. Where's DJ Khaled, bro? Where? How is he going to still be able to put out these We The Best songs when everybody's beefing like this? I don't know. I don't know. That's very interesting to me. DJ Khaled been very quiet on everything. Very quiet. Very, very quiet. He usually dropped music around the summertime, but he's been very, very quiet. I guess he's in a Bad Boys 4 movie. Shout out to him for that. But I want to see what DJ Khaled thinks about this Drake Kendrick Lamar beef. This Drake Rick Ross beef, you feel me? He got a bunch of songs with Drake and Rick Ross. You feel me? I want to know about that. And last but not least, French Montana, Fabio Foreign, and Fabulous is going on tour. That should be dope. I ain't gonna lie, that should be dope. That should be dope. Uh, FFF tour, I like that. I like that. Three different generations. Fab is damn near like the 90s. French is the early 2000s. You feel me? Not even. Fab is the early 2000s. French is like the late 2000s, and then Fabio Foreign is like the 2020s, you feel me? So that's going to be a good tour. I ain't going to lie, I'm interested to see that. This has been Hip Hop News Weekly. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll be back with more.